fart faces. It's me, Bev B, and my voice is almost back to normal. I'm very excited. But today, I want to show you guys something different. So I was contacted by DP Clubs, dpclub.com, I believe. I'll put all the links in the description box below, especially the link directly to this product that I'm going to show you guys. But I was contacted by them, and they asked me to pick some products for review. And I was like, why don't I review some things that I haven't really seen anyone else review besides, like, because I know we all do, we all review diamond paintings, etc. And I was like, let's do some accessories so I asked them for this this is a diamond painting tray whatever you want to call tray organizer whatever you want to call it it comes with everything that you see here and you get to choose the color so you can I believe there's like blue and pink and everything but I went with purple just because purple is my favorite color so I'm gonna look through this this is how it came it I was probably packaged a lot nicer but then in transit coming from overseas it probably just got like I don't know messed up in the mail but let's take a look at this uh, I'm really excited I didn't realize there were so many pieces to it so that is really cool if you're new here though and if you like diamond painting you like diamond painting videos go ahead and click the subscribe button I'd love it if you did um if you click the bell notification, you'll get notified when I upload new videos, which I do on an almost daily basis. Okay, so first off, we have some clips. We have four, two, four, six. We have six clips. So these can probably hold down your diamond paintings to maybe your light pad or something like that or to your, to whatever surface you want or maybe if you roll your diamond painting you can clip the rolled part together with that so that these are really nice and they seem pretty sturdy they're plastic and metal i think if you can see that i'm filming this at 11 o'clock at night so hopefully the lighting isn't too bad so we have those and then we co it comes with a variety of these pens. I really like them because they're purple. Um, purple is the best color. And they have, so it comes with four pens and they all have squishies. They all have single placers. There's a three placer, a straightener, a, I'm going to guess, what is this? A four, t no, an eight, a 10 placer maybe? 10 placer and a six placer maybe five placer six placer so those are the pens that it comes with i really like that they come they each come with a squishy especially if you don't have like fancy hand turned diamond painting pens the squishy thing really helps with your with the comfort of when you're diamond painting with the thinner pens so that's cool then it comes with some baggies, and these seem to be larger baggies than regular ones. Yeah, they're they're bigger than the ones you sometimes get for free with other diamond painting kits. And they are pretty, like, they're pretty thick, so it's not like those cheap, flimsy ones. I don't know how many is in here, but you get a whole ton of them. Get some labels. So these labels are probably, I'm guessing, you can either put them on the baggies or you can put them on these containers. You get some purple wax. I personally has, have never tried purple wax before, so I'm very curious. Um, it looks like... Eh. Eh. Okay, I can't get it out. But there's three of these inside of here, inside this container. So you get three things of purple wax. A funnel so let's open up this funnel it's the collapsible funnel I think it's silicone there's just some extra silicone -y bits on it um, you go like this and then you can pour your diamonds into there your drills into there and then it would it would go into a container so that's kind of handy I like the size of this it's not too big this will fit a decent size like it'll fit in here it'll fit like harbor freight and elizabeth ward i think so that's cool then you get one six 
seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten squares of, pur of purple wax again. I don't know what the difference is between these. This purple wax looks darker than this purple wax, but I, I honestly don't know if there's a huge difference. Again, I've never used purple wax, so I don't know if it performs better than pink wax, but you do get 10, 10 slices, 10 slices of cheese <laughs> and three circles of cheese. Then it comes with all these trays. I'm missing one. Oh, here. So it comes with one, two, three, four, five, six, six of these purple trays. They're just, they're small trays. Here it is compared to a Muni Made large tray. So I mean, they're pretty small, but if you are into confetti, if like, um, if you're into diamond painting and you have a very confetti heavy painting, these might come in handy. And then it comes with six of these little four, one by four containers and they just open like that and it comes with this pet is this a pen oh this i this is a light okay so do i have a battery i do not have there's no battery in it but this is a light it's like a flashlight. Um, I don't think I even own batteries to put in this pen. So I can't show you that, but trust me, it looks like a flashlight. So that would be helpful, I guess, if you can't see a symbol. Uh, maybe you, you don't have a light pad or maybe you're working on a diamond painting where it's easier to see the symbol if you have overhead lighting. So that might become in handy. And then it comes with a brush. So you can use this brush for getting the gunk out between your dime between your drills on your diamond painting this is pretty s sturdy brush i actually might repurpose this so i can clean underneath my nails that's disgusting i know but maybe and then let's look at this board so it came with this board it's very sturdy it's sturdy wood like, I thought it was going to be kind of like flimsy cheap wood, but no, it's actually, I don't know anything about wood. It, I think it's particle board. It looks like it's layers of particle board pressed together, but it is, it's pretty nice. This is the back of it. So it would just sit on your desk. Um, let's figure out where everything goes. Oh, also it came with this bag of multi-placers and there's actually a crooked, or a limp, <laughs> I like to call it the limp single placer. There's actually a limp single placer, straightener, a 10 placer, a six placer, three placer, and a single placer. So if you ever wanted to try the limp single placer, that might be the one for you. <laughs> okay, so I imagine you put these here. So put them back here. I don't know why I took them out. And then over here, I'm guessing this would be, well, this would probably go here. And then for here, is that where your pens go? Like what goes in these slots here? Hmm. So we have our pens. Could our pens go in here maybe? Possibly. It's working. I don't really know. Do you think, do you guys think that's what it's for? I will consult the picture and include that on um, my video so we can take a look. If I remember, hopefully I'll remember and I'll put it in the video. And we'll see if it actually shows the layout of what, where everything goes. But I'm guessing pens or something are supposed to go here. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay. <laughs> Fail. This could go there. This goes there. And then these could go here. I'm just going to pretend that's where it goes. And then we have this square. I'm not sure, like, we could put the funnel there. 
That might be good there. Or we could put plates of wax. Or we could put Smarties or candy hearts or something. I have no idea what goes here. What could go there, guys? What's square? What's rectangular? I don't know, but this is a really cool kit. Um, I don't know if I necessarily use this because just because I like to use just one tray. I don't like having multiple trays. My desk is not that big. So if you have a large working area, this actually might be perfect for you. Um, I do like the idea though of having six colors out, especially if there's like a lot of 310 or a lot, like a lot of black drills or a lot of white drills or a lot of like, or you could like take out all the ABs and have them on display as you're working on your diamond painting. I like this idea where everything, like, it's kind of like a mini workstation for your desk. Like, everything that you have is is here. These containers, I really love these containers. I think they look really awesome, like chef's kiss, as Jade would say. They look really great, um, like, when they're kit up because they, they just look nice. I don't know. They're aesthetically pleasing, but they don't hold a lot. So I'm thinking if you're working on a 30 by 40 or 40 by 50 this actually might work out very well for you but for a larger diamond painting like let's say 50 centimeters and over this might be too small for you and there might not be enough of these like you probably will have run into having to have excess storage to store all your um to store all your drill colors let's see one two three six Six times four. You guys made fun of me last time I tried to do math. Six, 12, 18, 24. Oh, wait. Six times four. Yeah. No, wait. Yeah. 20. So it will hold. Oh, my goodness. Comment down below if you love my struggle. It will hold 24 different colors. So this is good for like the snack size, more budget friendly diamond paintings. And I guess you could put your multi-placers here or something or like I would probably just put a snack here to be honest, a little snacksies. But um, yeah, I really like this. I think the like I'm not I'm probably not going to use this board I'll probably do a giveaway with it when I hit 3,000 subscribers but it's it's interesting I I'm kind of digging it like I wish that I did have a, a desk that was large enough for this and I wish that like I liked working on confetti but I'm one of those people who just likes working out of containers with one big tray but this is really nice though like I think this is really great quality and yeah what do you guys think about this I mean it comes with some really neat stuff like I've never had a brush before and this will be really good for cleaning out the wax like any wax residue between the drills or maybe even cat hair and you can use it to clean underneath your nails if you're disgusting like me. I'll just put that there. Oh, and then it comes with like a hand. Does that look like a hand, guys? That totally looks like a hand. That's interesting. I don't know what the hand would do. You could, you could touch things with the hand. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. And then the pink or the purple wax. And then these labels will come in handy. Honestly, if it were me, I'd probably just write 1 to 24 on them and then just put them on the containers. I don't kit up by DMC, as you can tell. Like, I have these containers. I don't kit up by DMC. I just put uh, numbered labels on everything. And that way, when I kit down, it's not annoying because I literally just kit down and put drills inside of a jar or in a giant bag. So, Yeah. What do you guys think of this? It's it's aesthetically it's aesthetically pleasing. Oh no, one of them. So this one actually looks like it cracked, and that's probably from the mail. I don't know if you guys can see that little crack there, but I think that was probably from the mail. I'm not too worried about it. Like I've had one of my other containers similar to this crack in the lid, and I just literally put tape on it, and it's been fine. Like it's not a huge deal or anything, but um. Yeah, that's that's it, guys. This is the the tooly thing I was talking about. So I'm very excited. I think that 
like if this is appealing to you and like you know that you would use it this would be super useful for someone not like someone not me but if you like working on snack size diamond paintings a lot this would probably be a really good tool for you I really like it. It looks, it just looks really nice. Like literally, literally, I would just take Instagram photos with this on my desk and then be like, okay, I'm done now. And then I'd put it away. But it's aesthetically pleasing. I love the purple. Again, it comes in several different colors. I will leave a link down below to this set if you are interested in getting it. I don't think it was that expensive. And for what you get, like, it's I think it's around 30 or 40 dollars but like what you get is it's like if you're new to diamond painting and you needed all this stuff it's all in one kit so that's pretty handy anyways let me know what you guys think of this set down below I'm curious to hear your thoughts is this something that you would use in on your desk um is it practical for you let me know, comment down below, and if you're new here and you like diamond painting and this video was helpful to you, go ahead and click the subscribe button. I do post new videos on a regular basis, and I'll see you guys in my next video. And thank you very much to DP Clubs for sending this to me. Bye!